Welcome back. Time now 925 in this Saturday morning. It is time for Imagine It. Carl Nelson's here from the Imagination Station, and I'm a little concerned, as usual, when you show you up. Be concerned. <laughs> We're going to talk about air pressure today, and we, we live under like miles and miles of air. Right. And all that air is pressing down on us puts about 14.7 pounds per square inch of force on our bodies. Okay. But you don't think about it because it's the same everywhere on your body. It's only interesting when there's a difference in air pressure. Okay? That's when things get fun. So, you know, a classic way to show that are some of like these suction cups. Mm -hmm. So if I flip these levers, I'm actually creating a little low pressure area inside, and a high pressure area is still on the outside. Okay. So if we try to pull these apart, not gonna happen. Not gonna, it would take like 360 pounds for both of us pulling on this, okay? I don't have that to offer. Right. Okay. And I don't know, that doesn't really get to the idea of what a difference in air pressure feels like. Hmm, okay. So the best way to do that is to actually take you and put you in a bag. Put me in, okay. We're gonna put, put you in a bag. bag. Okay. Now what we're gonna do is actually remove some of the air from the bag after we uh, put you inside the bag. So oh. If you could hold this. No problem. Put one hand down here. Okay. And put the cup the other hand below it. Okay. What we're going to try to avoid doing is sucking any of your clothes off here. Uh, that would be good. So let's keep the bag away from your clothes. And what we're going to do, <laughs> I've learned from experience to leave the head out of the bag. Thanks, Carl. Okay. I want to make it to the next segment. <laughs> All right. So now I have a vacuum pump, otherwise known as a shop vac, behind me here. All right. Okay. And you're going to give us a sense of what it feels like to have a difference in air pressure. Low pressure on inside the bag, high mm -hmm. pressure outside. Okay. Here we go. Now let it open, let it suck some air. Move your hand down. Yep. Okay. Take your clothes away. And as we start to remove the air from inside the bag, it's gonna start Ooh. shrinking up next to you. Yes. <laughs> it's gonna start getting really tight. Yeah. How does that feel? I feel like a mummy. Very <laughs> constricted. Okay. So it's kind of like a vacuum packed piece of chicken here yeah. or something. It's like, hmm. but can you feel the pressure? Yeah. Because we remove the air from the inside. Less air molecules pressing out, more pressing in, and you really get a sense of what a difference in air pressure feels like. Yeah, that's neat. Gosh, now I know how the, they feel in the meat department. Jeez. That's, that's, that's a nice look for you. <laughs> Thanks, Carl. All right, so that's an easy way then to kind of just get that basic. Get a sense. Although I would have to say, this is only something trained professionals should do. You shouldn't yeah. try this at home. Okay? No, especially if that bag were over the head, that could cause some don't major try. safety Don't risks. try that. Physics teachers do this all the time, um, and TV people do it, but don't try it at home. Okay. But again, it is a really nice demonstration of what the difference in air pressure can do. Awesome. You feel that. Carl, thanks. And you sure. guys also have bodies still going on? We bodies have bodies revealed, revealed uh, open still today, um, and also children 12 and under in Lucas County get in free today. So come down, check out Bodies Revealed, and bring the kids. Awesome. And that runs until September 18th. Carl, thanks so much for stopping in and sure. uh, sucking the life out of me. <laughs> <laughs> Stay with us. We're back with another half hour of news after this.